Good morning children. In the next series of life skills, I am going to teach you a few very simple recipes which can be made without fire. They don't require any cooking and that very easily with a little help from your mom you can make them. Now during this lockdown period, I want you to take care of your mom. So you prepare these simple recipes and give her a treat. So let's begin. So today we are going to make refreshing ruosa and two types of sandwiches. One is cucumber sandwich and the other is tomato and cheese sandwich. First we are going to make refreshing ruosa. We need a glass, water, ruosa, some ice cubes. and a straw. Straw is optional. Now pour a little roux of za into the glass. We don't need to add sugar. Pour a little water. Stir it. We'll add a little more water, stir it again to make sure that ruosa has dissolved completely. Now put some ice cubes. We have not added sugar into it because ruosa itself is very sweet. Now put the straw and there you go. Now we will make sandwiches. We need four slices of bread, chopped cucumber and tomatoes, butter, cheese slice, some salt, pepper if you like and a few cloves, oregano and some pizza pasta sauce. Now we begin with cutting the bread in a circle. You can place a small bowl on top of the bread and take out the bread which is coming out of the bowl so that it becomes a circle. Here we are. Now do the same thing with the other slice another circle you can press the bowl so that the outside bread can be taken out easily we have another circle of bread now we'll apply generous amount of butter because the butter on bread tastes really nice and it is also good for health so cover the entire slice, do the same thing with the other slice, yes, yes, here we go, yes. Now we'll place the chopped cucumbers because we are making a cucumber sandwich first. If you like, you can put a little lemon on it. Squeeze a little lemon juice if you like. This is entirely optional. Now press it after putting the other slice of bread. Now we are going to garnish it. We are going to take the cloves and make two eyes Now take a chopped tomato and make a nose of it. Now with the pizza pasta sauce, we are going to make the mouth. So 
There we go. Sandwich is looking lovely. I'm sure your mom will be so happy to see such a nice sandwich prepared by you. Now we are ready to plate it. We'll place the sandwich into the plate and we can garnish it also. Put some slices of tomatoes and cucumbers. And here we are, all set. Now take one slice of bread and spread pizza pasta sauce on it. If you don't have pizza pasta sauce, not to worry. You can spread either chutney, green chutney or tomato ketchup. We are going to spread the sauce on the next slice as well. Because I know this sauce is just yummy. Now we are going to put the cheese slice on the bread. Open it slowly, slowly, slowly. Ah, it's a little tricky. Be patient. Yes, we are nearly done. Wow, so we have opened it. Now we are going to place the cheese slice on the bread. We'll put tomato slices. We can sprinkle a bit of salt on it. We're going to sprinkle only a bit because the sauce already has salt in it. Now we are going to sprinkle oregano. It gives a nice tangy taste. Now place the other slice. If you want, you can cut it from the center. It's optional. Now we have two triangular tomato and cheese sandwich. Ready to eat.